An estimated 10% of the population of the Americas, or more than 62 million people, has diabetes, and more than half a million die from it annually. That makes diabetes the fourth leading cause of death in this hemisphere, after heart attacks, strokes, and dementias. On April 7, 2016, World Diabetes Day, UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon described diabetes as an ancient disease that is taking a growing toll on the modern world. Regionally, CARICOM called for urgent action and recognition for the health burden that Caribbean governments are facing due to diabetes and other non-communicable diseases. And locally, the Viewfort-based International American University, IAU, focused on the need for lifestyle and nutrition changes. According to the Pan American Health Organization, many people with diabetes develop serious complications, including blindness, nerve damage, and circulation problems leading to amputated limbs, kidney failure requiring costly dialysis, and heart failure. Power officials say the main culprits for this are unhealthy diets and physical inactivity. One of the event's guest speakers, Senator Deborah Tobia, used the opportunity to promote healthy eating. IAU officials say they remain committed to educating the public and doing their part to help address issues like diabetes, which affects families, communities, and countries. The World Health Organization estimates that by 2035, 592 million people, or one person in 10, will have diabetes.